ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kevin Jackwitz, this is The Cage Review, and I'm going to take a look at the Collector's Edition from Mortal Kombat 11. This is the reveal they did at the actual game reveal. Um, now, sorry, some of these MK videos are going to be coming late. I've been, like, in the hospital and just had a lot of things preventing me from recording. Um, and that being said, um, I gotta be honest, I, w I would say that this is, like, you know, an in-depth look, but there's not enough here to be an in-depth look. Um, and I'll go ahead and play this for you real quick, and I'll show you the collector's edition, and I'll give you my thoughts. Whoa! Okay, that mask looks incredible. What is it? You have one! I actually have this it's a cool mask. mask! It wasn't magic, I just walked back there. This is one of the <laughs> coolest collector's editions we've ever done. In addition to this mask, if you pre-order any version of the game, you get Shao Kahn and access to the beta, which begins on March 28th. Man, I... Which I have. I don't want this. I need this. I know. <laughs> Put I know. me down for one, I, I am sold, and you can purchase yours too at your local GameStop here in the United States. For everyone else around the world, get more information at MortalCombat.com. That just about wraps Okay, so there's the wrap up. That was the big reveal for the collector's edition. Here's my thoughts on it. I have bought literally every collector's edition of a Mortal Kombat game made in the last two decades. Literally every version. This, I was not sold on. A, because I already have a scorpion mask, but B, the price they put on this was nuts. $300 for a fucking mask. I thought that was insanity. Um, you have, okay, this is what you get with every pre-order. Shao Kahn, and you get... The beta access, which starts on March 28th instead of, like, April 17th or whenever it comes out. Um, so that's kind of an automatic thing. You get the $99 version, and you also get the DLC pack. Okay, well, obviously I'm going to want all the characters, so I went ahead and got the DLC pack. So all of that's already bought, paid for, it's on the way. I've got Shao Kahn, I've got the beta access, and I'm going to have the DLC pack. So to spend an extra $200, you get a different case that has a detachable magnet and a scorpion mask. And that is it. And I was like, nope, that, that's not worth it to me. It's just not. Now, if you were to come out with some cool statues like you did with MKX, I got that. Uh, when Mortal Kombat 9 was released, they released two collector's editions, and I got both of them. The one with the bookends, um, and it had like an art book in it, and you had the combat cards, and the other one had the fight stick. Well, I really wanted the fight stick, and so I bought that as well. Um, but this, there, there's nothing here that says I need to buy this extra crap for $200. Uh, I think the fight stick was $300 all together, which is what this is, and you get an actual arcade fight stick, an actual Mortal Kombat setup. And so, how does that translate going from $300 to that really cool ass, you know, Mortal Kombat fight stick to a mask? It does not compute to me. So, the game itself, I'm sure, is going to be amazing. I've already got it, and that's unlocked, and I've got all the specials that come with it, the pre-order bonuses, the, the DLC packs, because I'm sure all that's going to be worth it. But I, I was really disappointed when I saw that, because I really wanted to get some kind of collector's edition in this. So that's kind of where I'm at, man. Uh, some people are going to be sold on it, and that's fine. You spend your money how you want to. I wouldn't try to tell you how to do it. I'm just saying, for me personally, I didn't think that was very good at all, especially for the price point. 
So that's where I'm at with it, ladies and gentlemen. It's the only thing about this that I have not liked. Everything else has been absolutely amazing. The game looks phenomenal. So that's where I'm at. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you enjoyed this, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. My name is Kevin Jackowitz, Cage Nation, out.